Hi guys, um, today I'm going to show you how to set up uh, a Discord webhook so that when someone submits a contact form or any form and they click send, it'll send a message to a Discord server like this and with all your settings set up. Um, Elementor has already done a video on this except they have errors now and sometimes it doesn't work. So I'm going to show you the fix to that as well. Um, so for starters, you're going to go into your backend. You're going to see that there's your contact form or you just add your contact form. And then you're going to look on the left here. You're going to click on it and then go to content and then click on actions after submit. Now you can add your collect submissions and email and whatever you want here as well. But we're going to look at the discord one today. So click on this little plus and then type in discord and click on this one. Now you'll see this section popped up so we can edit the settings for that. Now go to your Discord pop-up here and then under webhook URL we're going to need to go into Discord and then I'm going to delete this one so we can start it from fresh. Click on the, hover over the channel you want the pop-up to be sent to and click on this little settings and then go to integrations and click on create webhook here and then you'll see that's been created and we'll call this one, you can call it whatever you want, it doesn't really matter. I'm going to call mine contact form. And then we want to make sure it's going to the contact form channel and you can add a little profile picture if you want. We're not going to do that. And you can click on copy webhook URL. Make sure it says copied and then just click save and you can close that. Now if we go back to our website and where it says webhook URL here, we paste that what we just copied and you can add all this and set a color. For example, I'll set this to blue and then you can click on update and that should save your settings. Now this is where it doesn't always work. If I'll try this and you'll see if I just send a test and then click send, it should send to the channel. And in Elementals tutorial, that's what they say to do, but it doesn't work as you can see. So we're going to go back to our backend. And on this URL where it says HTTPS discord.com, we're going to change discord to discord app. So you see there, D-I-S-C-O-R-D A-P-P. So you gotta add that Discord app in there and then leave the rest. And now if you click update and we refresh our page back here and I'll say, and you can show links and stuff as well. And if you click send, you'll see you've got a little Discord notification and there you go. It's got your name, your message, and if you had other fields it would show them there and it's in that blue that we selected. I hope this tutorial helped you. If it did, please like and subscribe to the channel for more content and comment if you had any issues.